Welcome my friends, welcome to the murder table. So tonight's tasting at the murder table, we are having a beer from Cigar City called Margarita Goza. Tropical influence meets innovative brewing in this tart margarita inspired ale. Effervescent on the palate, our Margarita Goza utilizes orange peel, lemon and salt. I'm sorry, lime and salt to create a zesty, light bodied and entirely unique beer experience. This beer clocks in at 4.2% ABV, 5 IBUs. Throw on your Hawaiian shirt and your later hosen and meet Cigar City Brewing at the intersection of traditional German brewing and tropical relaxation. We've taken our German style Goza, an ancient style of low alcohol beer brewed with salt and given it the Jimmy Buffett treatment by adding orange peel and lime essence to create the perfect warm weather ale. Sounds delightful. Since this is not a wheelhouse beer for Limp D, I thought I'd fly solo on this one and try the Margarita Goza. So I'm gonna crack this thing open and give it a pour. And I'm using my favorite glass, the old main beer company. Let's see if I don't botch this. Pour is very nice, sounds very fizzy. Getting a pretty good head here. So it looks pretty good. It's got a nice little um, light pale orange color. It's a little bit on the hazy side. Truth be told, I could smell the lemony goodness, the lemony limey goodness from here. So I'm going to go in for a nosing. Now, head retention wise, there wasn't a whole hell of a lot of that, but I think I found this to be pretty typical with a the sour. They just don't seem to have the bubbles that hang on for dear life like they do in an IPA or maybe even a stout. Definitely getting the, uh, the citrus, maybe a little bit of salt. It's a bit of a mix, mix on the, on the citrus side. It's like a little lime, a little lemon, a little bit of orange, which is what they said is in there. And when you get into the tasting notes, they say that there's aroma of ripe limes, lemon zest, and Valencia orange. Now I wouldn't know a Valencia orange from uh, a blood orange or any other kind of orange, but I'll, I'll take their word for it. So nose wise, again, smells pretty good. It smells like, you know, a Goza and a margarita. Go figure. It's a little fizzy. It kind of surges a little bit and then just kind of goes flat. Good bit of tartness, not overly tart. There's a little bit of sweetness to it, but mostly what you get is the, you know, the limes and a little bit of salt. And um, not bad. It's a pretty refreshing beer. I'm not going to say it's the best Goza I ever had. But it goes down pretty easy. It's almost like a training wheels goza because it's not ridiculously tart. I mean, there's a little bit of pucker. And now it's getting more limey. And there's a little bit of salt, like maybe it was like a lightly rimmed glass. Very, very refreshing. Nice on a warm day. I would give it a B. You know, it's not it's not groundbreaking, but it's, it's good. It's easy drinking. And, um, you know, it is, as advertised, refreshingly tart. So if you like this review and all our other reviews where we go a little bit off the rails, I kind of went straight ahead here because I can only say so much talking myself. So please leave your comments below. Let me know how I did. And by all means, please subscribe to our channel. Cheers.